Yo, what is up? Right now, I'm standing in Gua in a place called Guatape. <laughs> and uh, it's very hot out right now. And I'm gonna get burnt, but I like it. I'm gonna talk about the first six months of my journey when I was trying to overcome my stutter. Just a quick background. Oh, first of all, like what you should understand, what you, th what you will learn from this is certain, mis certain mistakes that I made that made my journey longer, made me see progress in my speech longer. Like it took a long time for me to see progress in my speech. So I'm gonna share with you the exact reasons why and what I learned how to actually start building confidence and how to actually stop feeling so much anxiety, worry, and doubt every single time I'm in a speaking interaction with a stranger in a group of friends or with someone that I'm just not that comfortable with. Before I start, quickly, if you do not know who I am, my name is Chase Gillis and I help people overcome stuttering the authentic way without speech techniques, without ear devices, but by addressing the real root issue of what is stopping us from speaking naturally and effortlessly how we already know we can speak. So the first six months of my journey started by watching videos on, you on YouTube every single night for hours on hours on hours. I would go throughout my day in a super, re super repressed, super hidden, super holding back type of mentality where I wouldn't say the words I wanted to say. I wouldn't speak up when I wanted to say something. So by the time I got to the end of the night, I was already fucking hurting. I was hurting so badly that the only possible outlet I had was trying to find some type of belief I can get out of, get out of this. And I'd spend my, all my nights watching videos on YouTube, consuming and consuming and consuming content. That was like the first six, the first six months. And that brought me absolutely no results. I knew all the theories, I knew all the speech techniques, but none of it ever helped me. And I was stuck in this, this, consistent this consistent routine of being the most inauthentic, hidden, trying to prove myself, trying to please others version of myself when I'm out during the day and getting some bit of excitement at night, thinking that all I need to do is watch one more video and I'll be good. And then I'd go out through my day again get super, super depressed, super sad, super inferior. I go to bed at night for two or three hours, watch some videos on YouTube of how to overcome stuttering. And it wasn't just me, like this, this vicious cycle, it's not just unique to me. I've coached dozens and dozens of people who went through the same type of experience where they feel like they will grow, they will grow if they watch YouTube videos over and over and over again. And the truth is, that has never helped me. It hasn't helped me in my speech, it hasn't helped me in my dating, it hasn't helped me in any type of self-development that I've been in. Watching content does shit all. It gives you theory, and it gives you a sense of like, it's almost like watching porn. Like it makes you feel good in the moment, but in the end, you're only fucking yourself. Like you are not going to grow from it unless you take actions to prove this theory that you learned is true for yourself. Because your brain can understand something. Your, your brain can, un, can understand it. I don't wait for that over. Now, nah. your brain can understand a theory, but to actually realize it for yourself is when it starts making an impact on your day-to-day -day speech. 
So even this video right now, you learn that watching YouTube videos and being in a hidden repressive mentality throughout the day isn't going to help you. But until you like truly realize that for yourself, not just simply understand it, but you truly, truly understand and you truly realize that for yourself, you will not actually make improvements to your speech. And this comes to the the overarching theme of why I'm sharing this with you right now is that you need to understand things for yourself. I don't care how much you watch of me and I don't care how much you learn, but until you go out and you prove this shit is true and you prove that all this shit that you learned actually applies to you, it will not have any effect on you. So this is my call to action for you. I know if you're watching these YouTube videos and you're not taking action and you don't have an action plan that you follow, you will not see results. And it is my calling, it is my purpose in life, at least for right now, it may change later, it's my purpose in my life right now to help as many people who stutter overcome their stutter. So my call to action for you right now is to actually start going and applying everything that I have taught you. Everything that you have learned from me so far, go and apply it. And you may think, all right, where do I start? What do I do? What mindset should I have? What should my first action be? And if that's the case and you truly, truly want to overcome your stutter and you're willing to take the actions and you don't want to watch any more content and you're really ready to start changing your life, then the absolute best way would be to look at the closest link down below in the description. You'll see the first link is a free one-on-one -on -one call with me. That is where we can talk one-on-one. -on -one. We can examine your, examine your situation and give you a game plan of what to, actu what to actually do. And this is all, f this is all for free. This, this, call is for, this call is for free. And what we'll talk about and how you would personally overcome your stutter is also for free. It's only at the end of the call where I see if you would want to take this journey on with me and this is something you'd want to do with me while holding my hand throughout the whole the whole process but if you want a game plan of what to do the step-by-step -step action plan then make sure you click the closest link down below in the description so I can take a look at your situation and see what the exact next steps for what the exact next steps would be for you in your specific situation so without further ado i'll see you on the call book that call i love you and peace out